Hi everyone, so today I'm here with a new video on how I managed to decorate my house on a budget, on a low load. So if you are interested in decorating your house for Christmas and you're not trying to spend that much money, I give you all my tricks and the little things that I do just to save money. So please watch. <laughs> So today I got my house clothes on because I'm getting ready to decorate my house for the holidays. Christmas! Christmas time is the best time of the year. Now I am a newbie in this. This is my second year of having my own place. So I never really had a chance to like decorate. So um, I'm sure after the years um, go by, more years to come, I'll have even more decorations. So as of now, I'm just a starter. First thing first, this is a view of the house right before I started decorating. Now the first thing I'm going to remove is that piece of furniture on the corner because that is where I will be placing my Christmas tree. I bought my Christmas tree two years ago um, at a sale after Christmas and my tree was $50. I believe the original price was $120. Now this is my second time putting a tree up so I did get the order wrong but it didn't take me too long to figure it out. Now um, once I put all the pieces together, it came in three pieces, I started spreading out my branches. That way um, the tree doesn't look so naked and with a bunch of space in between. Now like I said before, I got my tree on sale and that's pretty much how I got half of the things that I did. After Christmas, they always have a 50% to 75% off on all the Christmas items because they're trying to get rid of it. So that is when I go shopping crazy. <laughs> so now I'm going to talk about the skirt. The skirt I did buy it from Family Dollar and it was like $5. The ribbons, I bought that from Family Dollar as well. And um, because they came short, I bought three and tied into a knot. That way it could be longer without me having to stop and put another one. Um, I did start from the bottom and then work my way up and um, wrapped it around my tree. Now here you can see I ran out of ribbon, but it's okay because I still made it look good. Now these are the ornaments that I also purchased last year that they were also 50% off so this was a box that I have not opened yet because it is brand new from last year Christmas some of the ornaments did not come with hooks so I did buy a pack of um, ornament hooks that was on sale last year now I'm just putting the snowflakes I believe that's what it's called this is also a brand new box that I have not opened, um, so I'm using those as well. Last year I did not have that many ornaments on my tree, so it looked pretty empty, but because it was my first tree, I was so proud of it and I was so hyped until I started seeing other people's tree on Facebook and I was like, oh my gosh, my tree is nothing compared to this. But I said I will step it up this year, so... <laughs> you guys will see it at the end so I did ended up going back to Family Dollar and buying an extra um, tinsel garland for the tree and um, that's only because I had ran out and I wanted the tinsel to go all the way to the top so here I'm putting on the star I didn't like the star so I ended up sticking to the ribbon I turned the lights on the Christmas tree on just to see what it looks like and I felt like it still needed some more ornaments so I added more. Here I'm just changing the candles and putting Christmas tree candles. Here I'm putting um, door breath on my door and here is some garland I got from Family Dollar. <laughs> And I just wrapped it around my curtains to make it look a little more Christmassy. 
So I found this big garland at um, Ross. I bought it. So I bought it last year. It was about $15. And I loved it on top of my uh, fireplace. I put the stockings on the fireplace. So here I'm getting ready to do my dining room table. And this is what I came up with. At first I was going to put that in the coffee table. But I decided to go with the dining table instead. So here I'm getting ready to do the curtains. So at first I had put two of the red curtains in the front and the tan in the back. So then I realized that I didn't like it as much. So then I put the tan curtains in between them. So then I had red, tan, red on each side. So now I'm about to take the cheap um, garland that I bought from um, Family Dollar. That's another one. So I bought two and I'm wrapping it around the curtain rod. And took an ornament out the tree and put it right in the middle. So these you guys are gold vases that I bought at a yard sale for 50 cents. Yes, I was so happy when the lady told me 50 cents. I also had bought that reindeer for a dollar. You can't really see it now, but I will get closer. Um, so that was like one of the best purchases that I ever made at a yard sale. <laughs> So now I'm back in the living room trying to find the perfect piece for my coffee table, my center coffee table. So this piece I had bought it from Ross. It was $25. Now I found this um, thing to put underneath of it and it wouldn't stay down flat. So I ended up using candles to make it stay and I kind of liked the candles so I ended up keeping the candles there. So now I'm trying to find the perfect candles to go on the side. The Christmas trees just didn't do it for me. So I ended up finding two tan ones and a green one, which looked way better. So this is the final look of the centerpiece. Hey guys, so I'm at my local thrift store and I cannot believe it. It is snowing. And it's before Thanksgiving. <laughs> So, yes, we're getting snow early and it's freezing cold. But yes, I'm at my local thrift store and I'm about to see what they have. So I'm going to check it out. Walking in, you can already tell that it's going to be a lot of Christmas items. So the back of the thrift store had a whole section of just Christmas items. So I was in there for a while. These are 50 cents candles that I found and I really like them and found some couch throwovers for $1.50 and I also found a new uh, Christmas tree skirt so I was so excited. Also a little mini Christmas tree with like sparkling Christmas trees and $2 candle garden that was brand new so I took advantage of it. Now I'm trying to put this coffee table together. I know y'all sick of me with these white Christmas tree candles, but I just could not find the perfect place to put them. So here I'm putting the candle garden together with that apple thing that I found. Took the pictures out and put in the new candles. So this is the final look of that coffee table. Now this is the skirt that I was so excited about. I got it for $5 and it looks expensive you guys. The other skirt was from Family Dollar and it, it did look cheap. But I upgraded guys so be proud of me. <laughs> but yeah I absolutely love this skirt. So this is a before and after from Family Dollar to an upgraded thrift store skirt. So guys, remember that small little tree that was in my bin? Well, I got it from the thrift store for $7.20. Originally, I had bought one from Ross for $12.99 plus tax. But then when I saw the one at the thrift store, I said, oh, I'm taking this, I'm taking this thing back. So I'm going to show you where I placed that little tree at. 
right next to my daughter's beautiful portrait on the computer desk. And guess what, you guys? I found a place for the white Christmas trees. <laughs> yes, finally. So remember those throwovers I got for $1.50? I made sure I washed them because they are coming from the thrift store. So please, guys, please wash them. And now they are the cutest thing on my couch. Another thing I got on sale last year was a wireless remote control for the tree. That way I don't have to climb underneath the tree just to turn it on. This is a quick and easy way to do so. And it was only $5. You can't beat that. So once again, I'm going to show you the before look of my living room, dining room area. And then I'm going to show you the after look, which is now. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I'm glad that you watched me transform my house once again. This is only my second year so I'm sure next year I'm going to have more decorations, different ones and even better. That is all for you guys today. So thank you for watching and I hope that you subscribe and like and hope to see you guys next video happy holidays everyone <laughs> yes christmas is coming up soon and if you feel like you need to go shopping make sure you buy those items after christmas 50 percent to 75 percent off now you cannot beat that all right so bye